What's up you guys, it's Matt here. So the crypto market does not look fantastic today, but there's definitely one position that I think we need to uh, keep our eye out for, which you know what it is because it is in the title, it's in the thumbnail, it's everywhere, XRP. Um, it's a position that I bought more recently when it was at a level of like 36 cents, 30 to 36 cents. <clears throat> And now we're seeing it at a higher level gaining every single day. And it just looks really, really positive. So I wanted to kind of go through where predictions were, at least an article of predictions and understanding where my prediction is for maybe 2023. Um, but also talk about why, you know, you can't stop XRP from exploding, really. You really can't. Um, it's going to explode. It's going to run to way higher figures. We're going to see it have a bigger use case, uh, be more valuable, be in more hands, more wallets. And overall, people are just going to be insanely happy. So guys, if you could make sure you hit the like button, hit the subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Also, make sure you guys check out some of the links down below. It does help out the channel. And if you guys want to follow me on Twitter at Perry 8K, you can follow me over there. Now, I wanted to make this video because <clears throat> the entire crypto market, like I said, is not really looking positive, right? You see it at $1.15 trillion market cap, which is still higher than what we've seen in the past, right? We've seen it at a $800 billion or $900 billion market cap. And right now we're seeing it at a 1.15. This is down from a 1.2 trillion dollar market cap. So you're seeing things that are, you know, falling, right? You have Bitcoin that's down 1%, you have Ethereum that's down 1%, right? Some things are starting to come back right now, but if you look at the bigger gainers right now, if you go to uh, past 24 hours, you're gonna see that XRP is third on that list for the past 24 hours, and it's up 16% in the last seven days. <clears throat> so XRP, has kind of been hovering around the same point, 44, 45 cents, um, but it's been up, right? When we see it uh, decrease down, we're seeing things that are starting to pump uh, for XRP, but everything else doesn't really look as positive. So you have a, a lot of uh, positivity that goes into um, this position, uh, especially, you know, hovering around, sorry, there's a cat hair flying around, especially hovering around, <clears throat> the uh the lawsuit right um the the sec versus ripple right if you're looking at that and you're seeing positivity which we are seeing positivity i just can't get that hair out of the air it like flies up as i swipe down at it um if you're seeing you know the positivity that's happening there and the potential positivity and how that can conclude this year i mean that would be absolutely fantastic and could be big for cryptocurrency overall but you know, XRP is kind of leading the way because of who's involved, right? You have Ripple that is involved with that battle with the SEC. And if they come out on top, yes, it may come out with a settlement, but if they do come out on top to where they can continue as is, um, I feel like that is a win. Um, but obviously, you know, the government just wants money. They always want money in every scenario. Like, yeah, well, you know what? Let's just settle because you just want millions of dollars to be paid out to individuals and to be to just be paid out to the government, right? So <clears throat> um, it's a problem there. But XRP is seeing all of the benefits here and seeing how, you know, it, how much of an impact it can have there. So with that being said, with understanding XRP, one, where is it right now? What are we seeing? Where is my uh, prediction? And then also um, maybe a prediction that we're seeing overall with a uh, another article where do they stand month by month and we've seen that before where some predictions were like a hundred thousand dollars two hundred thousand dollars other predictions were like a thousand dollars uh some predictions were in the single digit uh dollar range and let's stick around there until we see a major impact to kind of push us up to those levels or a major use case to push us up to those levels so currently if we look at XRP and the full breakdown, we're seeing it at a $22.7 billion market cap. Fully diluted would be 44.7. <clears throat> Current circulating supply, we're looking at $50.9 uh, billion. Uh, meaning that if we would see it back to old levels, which is about a 90 or $100 billion market cap, we're really looking at about a $2 price point, right? So $1 would be a $50 billion market cap, um, you know, two dollars would be a, a 100 billion dollar market cap so and can we go past that i do believe that we can go past that um but anyways fully diluted would be 44 so if you find a way to get to that and you're looking at 100 billion it would be a one dollar price point so 
And I don't know what's going to happen with everything that's that's there and if we're going to see major dilution that could happen. But you could see over these last couple of days that we've seen it kind of hover around the 44, 45 uh, range. It has dropped down to low 44s and then increased here up to uh, 45. So you could see here, uh, actually, this is in the past couple of days. This is the last day. Um, but you saw this drop down to 41 or 42, and now it went up to about 44 and then hovered around there. But the past seven days, we've seen this go up to about 50 cents um, and then drop down to a level of 42 and then increase to 45. So it seems like 45 is definitely a resistance point. But um, where are the predictions at? Because you're seeing $1.5 billion in volume, which is great to see. Where are the predictions? So XRP, <coughs> uh, crypto price prediction 2023, five coins, right? They're going into that. And this is where Ripple is. Um, uh, XRP price prediction for 2023. Um, uh, the value of a certain old coin, such as a Ripple XRP, has uh, increased in uh, recent weeks as many people uh, begin to speculate that the worst part of the bear market is behind us <clears throat> and uh, we're nearing the the new crypto cycle but everyone is wondering how will xrp develop by the end of the year it is possible that this coin will soon reach a value of a dollar uh, you can check the predicted uh, value for this crypto table below so as you scroll down here um, they're looking at it month to month march they're saying that it's going to get to a maximum price of 42 or 43 which it got to a maximum price of 50 so that kind of broke that table right away got to a maximum price of 50 cents so uh you see it go down here and it's not saying it's going to get to 50 cents until a level of august which i don't necessarily agree with i think things are going to run a lot further than that and they say by the uh, by december it'll be 62 cents which would be double where i purchased from but i do believe that it's going to go a lot higher than that uh, my prediction for if we are seeing a a bull market it starts out very very fast um and then starts to level out kind of like a a little bit of a a bull flag scenario so my expectation is to see this run up to uh, a level of maybe a, a dollar ish and then try and level out a little bit so uh, i do believe that it's going to hit a 50 billion dollar market cap if we are in that bull run um in that bullish market you never know what's going to happen with inflation and everything there it looks like we are easing we're we're still adding um you know in, uh, hiking up interest rates but uh maybe inflation will continue to decrease because of that and once we get to a certain point then we level off on the rate hikes <clears throat> because it's eight straight months of decreasing inflation so it's definitely interesting but what i think is going to happen is level out of about 90 cents to a dollar and then we're going to see the market start to pick up again and it's going to push up pump up to a level of maybe a dollar a dollar 35 a dollar 40 i know before it was at a dollar 80 um and hovered around there and that was you know i believe a 90 uh or maybe actually it was less supply i think it was like thirty thousand supply 30 or 30 billion sorry 30 billion supply um so you were looking at a $60 billion market cap, or if it got up to, you know, a level of, you know, $2 or so, it would be a, um, a higher market cap. I believe the highest point was like $3 and 40 cents or something. So it was definitely up at a higher market cap. It was at like the $100 billion market cap. So I do see that getting up to that point, but it's just, it's hard to see right from the start, especially being at a $22 billion market cap. So I expect to see this one stay at a $50 billion market cap until you hit higher prices to where things will get maybe a little bit diluted. That's usually when they do it. Um, and that's why you'll see maybe a little bit of the resistance that's happening. Introduction and in sells um, within the top or peak points. Um, but my prediction is uh, definitely up to that $1.40 range um, if we're going to see this bullish market in 2023. So let's hope for it. Um, XRP is definitely moving a little bit, broke barriers when it came to uh, getting past the 50 cent mark um, or getting past 42 cents. Right now it's above 42 cents as their prediction shows, uh, 42, 43 cents. It's above that and even was above that at one point. It was at 40, or sorry, 49 or 50 cents. So anyways, let me know what you think about this. Where is XRP going to stand? Do you believe that we're going to see a dollar plus this year? Um, and just be like realistic, be optimistic as well. Um, but let me know your opinions down below in the comment section. But hit the like button, hit that subscribe button, hit that notification bell for more videos like this one. Hopefully you guys have a great Saturday. Um, have a great start to your weekend. And I don't know if this is a start or a Friday is a start, but um, definitely have a, a good weekend. I'll most likely be here tomorrow, but I'm not 100% sure because it is going to be 60 degrees outside. So I may end up golfing at some point, but, uh,
I'm going to get out of here and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See ya.